It, then it didn't let up and then during the afternoon we got that round of rain that was yeah. kind of heavy came down really fast had some street flooding as well that really did deliver us a good extra little bit of some rain and then moved out of the area pretty quickly so overall uh, many of us walking away with a, a solid you know half of an inch to an inch some places saw a bit more than that but today all of that is out of here. The winds pick up and we look for some more sunshine. High temperatures today in the upper 40s to lower 50s, but we could have some wind gusts today as high as 30 to 40 miles per hour. Check out some of the rainfall totals from yesterday. River Hills up to two inches of rain. Whitefish Bay, we've got our report in from Bill Scott, uh, just over uh, an inch and a half, uh, 1.63 inches there. And then right here at TMJ4 on Capitol Drive, picked up over an inch in our rain gauge up on the roof and uh, numbers elsewhere anywhere between about a half uh, to a uh, half of an inch to an inch worth of rain. You can see here that little line on the uh, estimated rainfall graphic. This is from the radar. This is radar estimated rainfall. That's where that line set up and that's where we got some of that heavier bouts of rainfall. So right over northern Milwaukee County into portions of Waukesha County and then it dropped down to the south. Cold front has made its way through. So as we go forward in time, it looks like cooler air is on the way for the weekend. And now we've got a nice clear sky, so I'm excited about the sunrise happening a bit later on this morning. 43 degrees right now, Milwaukee, that northwest wind at about 15 miles per hour. Dew point currently at 30. Air temperatures inland in the lower to middle 30s, but more of us are around 35 or above. It's 36 right now in Waukesha, 38 Burlington, 39 for us right now in Lake Geneva. We're at 41 in Port Washington, 42 from Racine to Kenosha, and the current wind speeds all over the place, 5 to 15 miles per hour out of the north and west. So a bit breezy as you step out the door. We've had some 20 to 30 mile per hour wind gusts already so far this morning, and I do expect as the sun comes up, we start to mix that atmosphere up a bit more. We certainly could punch up to around 30 to 35 mile per hour wind gusts here by the middle of the afternoon. All right, out the door this morning. Yes, chilly mix of sunshine and a cloud deck a cloud cover off in the distance to the east, but it looks like we are enjoying a day of full sunshine with numbers in Milwaukee climbing into the lower 50. If you go a little bit farther to the north and to the west, that's where we'll have numbers today in the upper 40s. But look at this quiet for the days ahead. We've got high pressure moving in. It keeps things nice and dry and it keeps the sunshine around as well. So we give you a little preview here of the weekend. It will be a bit cooler for our Friday and Saturday as some cooler air drops in from the north. By Sunday, we do notice on our long range computer models that another batch of cloud cover moves overhead 52 degrees. So we'll look for a little bit more in the way of cloud cover, but all in all fairly typical for for November and then as we head into next week, sunshine is back, but some warmer air starts to flood in numbers topping out in the mid and upper 60s. We could get awfully close to 60 guys. Brendan, thank you. Come